Give them some moisture. Ooh, this is gonna be so good. I wish you could smell this. Today, I'm gonna show you how to make Korean barbecue skewers. We're going to make a super simple kalbi marinade and turn your beef skewers into Korean beef skewers. It is going to be a huge hit at your next barbecue party. 오늘의 레시피 갈비 양념으로 소고기 꼬치 구이 만들기. 오늘도 여러분들과 양호를 함께 하겠습니다. So I'm gonna go crash my neighbor's party. I think if I show up with this, right, they're gonna let me in, right? <laughs> Hi everyone, this is Helen and welcome to Modern Pepper. 안녕하세요, Modern Pepper의 Helen입니다. And today, we're coming to you live from Mexico. Okay, I wish. But today, we get to hear festive Mexican music courtesy of our neighbor, because uh, they're having a big party. And that's gonna put us in the mood for some yummy grilling. So this is a quick Korean barbecue recipe. We're gonna add half a cup of soy sauce, and we need one tablespoon of minced garlic, and we need two tablespoons of brown sugar, that's one, and two. And we need one tablespoon of olive oil, and we need some black pepper. I would do about a quarter teaspoon of black pepper, and then just mix it up until the sugar dissolves. And then I'm gonna take out one and two tablespoons of our marinade, and I'm gonna save this for later. And then I have about two pounds of sirloin steak cut into huge cubes. You could cut them smaller if you like, but I like to cook my skewer beefs kind of chunky and big like that. We're gonna add them in here, and then we're just gonna mix it. Ooh, that looks real pretty. Just make sure all the pieces are coated in our soy sauce mixture. Look at this piece. Does that look good or does that look good? So you could also use chicken or shrimp for this recipe. And then we're gonna cover this with a plastic wrap. If you are pressed for time, let this sit on the kitchen countertop for 30 minutes. Otherwise, we're gonna add this to the fridge and let it rest for about four to five hours. All right, now we're gonna get ready to skewer our skewers. So this is the marinade that we saved earlier. To this, we're just gonna add one tablespoon of water and we're gonna use this as our basting liquid later on. If you're using bamboo skewers, make sure to add some water and let it soak for 15 to 20 minutes. This is to ensure that the bamboo skewers do not burn away quickly. But today I'm gonna be using metal skewers. So I always like to start with one garlic clove, sort of as my fastener, and then grab two to three pieces of red onion because they cook fast. And then we're gonna grab our beef and then make sure to pack it down. And then I'm gonna add our mushroom and then beef again. And then our sweet bell orange pepper. And then just continue with another beef. This time I'm gonna put scallion, more beef, this time yellow pepper, more beef. And then I always like to end with a big piece of garlic like this. It's sort of as our fastener, so it keeps everything tight and compact. There's our first one. Then I'm gonna place it down here and keep on going. And of course you could use whatever vegetables you wanna add to your skewers or don't add them if you don't wanna add vegetables. Our Korean barbecue skewers are all ready to go. So here's a quick tip that I wanna share with you. When it comes to grilling, make sure to set your barbecue grill on super high heat and preheat for at least five minutes. So when it comes to grilling, you never ever wanna put your meat on a cooled grill. You always wanna put it so you hear that sizzling sound. Once you put the meat on the grill, do not poke it, do not touch it, do not lift it, do not peek it, just leave it alone. And we're gonna close the lid and keep the heat at super high. And we're gonna come back in three to five minutes. All right, let's have a look. Ooh, 
gonna turn this one over and see how it looks. Oh yeah, this is what we're looking for, a little bit of charred mark. And then we're gonna flip all these guys over, our last guy. Wow, that looks gorgeous. And here's some extra marinated beef that I made earlier. This is just meat only. We're just gonna sneak it in here and grill these guys. And here's our marinated liquid that we saved earlier and we added a little bit of water and we're just gonna do that. Give them some moisture. Ooh, this is gonna be so good. I wish you could smell this. And then we're gonna close the lid and come back in three to five minutes. These babies are ready. Look at that. Just charred bark all around, perfectly cooked. And then these beef only ones, we're just gonna let them cook a little bit longer and this is ready to go. Now make sure to let the skewers rest for at least five minutes so that all the juices retract within. Look at the juices flowing from our skewers. Oh, this is gonna be so yummy. Now make sure to tune in to next week's part two of our grilling recipe series. I'm gonna show you how to turn this plain Jane corn on the cob to this spicy version with this velvety gochujang salad dressing and also how to make this simple grilled romaine lettuce salad. So hit that notification bell. Here are our skewers with just beef only. Ooh, that looks like a yummy, yummy snack. Oh, does this look good or does this look good? Here we go, we're gonna take it off the skewers. Ooh, look at all the vegetables. Smells so good. Look at that, it's medium, just the way I like it. Our perfectly grilled Korean barbecue skewers. Look at that. I also wanna show you how juicy and meaty our grilled vegetables look. All right, my vegan friends make this with just vegetables or with tofu cubes as well. Bon appetit, everyone. Mm. First of all, I need to have two margaritas and me to start really dancing for you, but so I'm not gonna do that. Wow, this is juicy, so flavorful, and then the grilled vegetables just adds that natural, sweet, sugary taste. Oh, this is so yummy. So make it at home and enjoy it. All right, so I'm gonna go crash my neighbor's party. I think if I show up with this, right, they're gonna let me in, right? <laughs> anyway, I wanna thank everyone for watching today, and if you enjoyed watching today's video, make sure to click on that like button and subscribe if you did not subscribe yet. 여러분 오늘 재밌게 보셨으면 꼭 좋아하는 버튼 눌러주세요. 구독 버튼도 눌러주시고요. 다음 비디오에서 뵙겠습니다. All right, folks, I will see you in the next video coming up right now.